Steph, uh, Gingrich, is that how you say it? Yeah, that's right. What kinds of radio have you done before? God, let's see. What haven't I done? College radio, small town station, did a couple podcasts, lots of live mixing for my band. Oh, okay. So you know your way around an audio booth. Yeah, totally. Your friend did tell me you were overqualified for this job. I just assumed he was, you know. Being Gabe? Right. <sighs> well, look, if you can handle it without much supervision, the job's yours. Awesome. Now, part of your responsibilities would be managing the record store. Given all your retail experience on your resume, I'm sure that won't be a problem. Oh, right. Yeah, no problem at all. Great. So your friend said you quit your band to be here. Can I ask why? Sorry. Maybe that's too personal. No, it's fine. Um, no big reason. I'm just trying to... Okay, there was a breakup involved. Ah. So I wanted a change of scenery, a new job in a gorgeous place. Well, I hope we live up to expectations. Haven Springs is no Seattle. I think I'll love it. Okay, the manager left me a task list for my first day. So that's probably around here somewhere. Are you the Haven High mascot? Hard to hold a pickaxe without thumbs? So wait, you're a bird and a miner? Great, here's the list. Introduce myself on air? Huh. Let's give this a shot. Need to turn this on first. Bet I could get these to stick to the bulletin board from here. What's up, Kind Haven listeners? Steph here. Your new DJ at KRCT, live every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And uh, maybe more in the future. We've got some great music coming up for you, so uh, keep it here. You're listening to KRCT. Well, I promised great music, so... Next up, check out the playlist. This is Haven's number one indie rock playlist. Pretty sparse. It'll do, I guess. Hello. Sorry, computer DJ. <laughs> it's my turn now. Shaking things up already, Gingrich. Maybe I can play a few more songs today. Now I'm supposed to read some ad copy. That must be around here too?
a new local business to get excited about. Avalanche Ice Cream in downtown Haven Springs. The variety of flavors they've got is gonna blow your freaking mind. You think I'm kidding? These guys have, and I hope you're sitting down, Crab Rangoon flavored ice cream. Just saying. So come on down to Avalanche Ice Cream and get yourself a scoop from our good pals. Sonny and Angela Anderson, the best neighbors a hungry DJ could ask for. Ooh, I need a break. I'll just step away from the desk for a sec. I'm gonna be shaking up the playlist a bit here at KRCT. So get your ears ready for some fresh tunes and keep it here. A message from one of KRCT's sponsors, the Black Lantern. Here in Haven, the Black Lantern is known for its bearded proprietor. Prefer your dinner served by a man from the 1800s? Then look no further. And then there's the food. Try the lanterns. Top notch burger game. Best burgers for 20 miles in any direction, bar none. Stop by the Black Lantern today and tell them Steph sent you. Colorado.com has been putting Coloradans to work since 2002 using their licensed experts. These people are like career Sherpas, helping you scale the mountain of your dreams. But Steph, you say, I'm a unique artisan with a highly specialized skill set. No way they'll have a job for me. To which I say, not with that attitude. And just for my listeners, get a free trial membership with promo code KRCT. Bridge. This is your life. Next, gotta out myself as a media snob. It's only fair. What kind of stuff do I want to name drop? And top it off with a dash of what I'm looking for.
You're kidding. Guess I should probably break the ice. How do you introduce yourself to someone named Bubbles? Probably work for me to do in the store as well. I think there was a note for me on the front counter. The scariest thing about this book is the menacing overdue notice I get once a year. maybe three conversations with Eleanor, and she's already giving me flowers. I can see why Gabe loves her. That's probably gonna be my dinner. Gabe, your girlfriend is too good for you, man. Feel like I'd get along with this woman. So, if I read that right, Tasha's basically giving me carte blanche. I can work with that. I'll check out those posters. Maybe there's something to spruce up the walls. As for music, I can at least start it by updating the new releases. And, yep, there's the vent. Might as well take a look. are like two years old. 
happy releases. What do we have? It's throwback time. Shit. It, that's coming from inside the booth. My first call. Better go answer it. CT Radio, and you're talking to Steph. Yo, this is the record store? Hmm, depends what you mean by this. What? See, this is a radio booth within a record store. And this voice you're speaking to, me, is a DJ who also works at the record store. But this phone call, as I mentioned, is decidedly for the radio. Follow? Uh, no. Could I just give you my order, and you can just, like, give it to whoever? <sighs> yeah, why not? Sweet. All right, uh, I got Goodbye Means Forever by Kim Snyder, Going Our Separate Ways by The Seagulls, Don't Let the Door Hit You by Robbie Rooster, Oh, boy. What? No, nothing. Just, who are these for? My girlfriend. I saw them in her wish list online and decided to surprise her. Buy local, you know? Yeah, yeah, cool. Yeesh. I don't think this kid realizes that his girlfriend is loading up on breakup music. Okay. Look. Maybe you're putting too much effort into this relationship. Could be time to consider other options. What? Why would you say that? <sighs> Alright, dude. Listen. I'm pretty sure your girlfriend's breaking up with you. How the hell would you know that? Gee, I don't know. Guess I'm psychic. Whatever, lady. Screw this. Thanks for calling KRCT. The only other time I've used a landline was to call my cell phone. If you need me, honey, I'll be here for you. Even though right now you think that guy is on the moon. French cuisine and you? Learn to shred on the guitar in 60 days. Mastering your email? Chapter 1. Turning your computer on. No contact for two years. Then this mysterious package? <laughs> well played, Mikey. If I emptied all these out, I could make a wicked fucking fort. But I'm not doing that right now. Hmm. One of these might work. That sounds promising. Cool. 
Why, yes, I did put up a poster of cute girls flexing. Let's not all act surprised at once. Treat yourself this Valentine's Day. Call Fred's snow removal. What the hell? When's the last time someone even used this? One day, bad clip art is gonna make a comeback. And when that day comes, I'll be ready. All those years of high school set design were preparing me for this moment. Oh, it just needs some screws. Is there an animal in there? Hey, you in there. I'm coming back tomorrow with Febreze and a broom. So consider yourself warned. Analysis of the sonata form and its relation to musical structure and choice? <laughs> Whoa, who's the heavyweight thumbing through these bad boys? Oh, our raccoon friend, I assume. Clearly not toilet trained. One day, if you're brave, unselfish, and true, you can be a real guitar. Sheet music too? This store can't make up its mind. Not Kasha's favorite musical, I take it. Oof, we need to get this sucker filled up. I had this melody in my head all night. Finally got out of bed and recorded it. I wonder how it sounds now. I could give it a listen, see if I still like it. This is actually pretty sick. I guess upgrading from humming to actual music is a good next step. Okay, so what instrument should I play this thing on? Yeah, I bet it'll sound cool as a guitar riff. Yeah, this place definitely needs an update. Talking to my Paul the other day about growing up. He said I was held to raise by from a little cup. Every time he tried to show me which way I should go, I turned and walked the other way just to let him know. Oh,
This is Haven's number one indie rock playlist? Yeesh. I may have no clue what I'm doing, but the good news is, maybe no one is listening anyway.